also YouTube. I met the writer of Roy of the Stage Play, Chris Clanton, at, um, it was actually on set of Beyonce music video for Superpowers. Dope as hell. A few months later, he hit me up, did some atmosphere, and made me a period piece for a bar scene. And I'm like, cool, yeah, like, you know, that's what's up. And, you know, he was from Maryland too. Mm -hmm. And he's supposed to be based in 1968. And, um, you know, amazing dances going on. Um, I did a little research and I was freaking like blown away like they're ridiculously talented like they were giving you everything in 1968 you know I've always loved Soul Train but to look at it from like a technical aspect like, they were giving you soul they were giving you locking they were giving you just get down at the club chain of fools they had this groove and I was just like yes what is that like I, I totally <laughs> have to use that freaking Tina Turner no, turn. Land of a Thousand Dances. I'm looking at this choreo and it's like Beyonce's dancers could be doing this today. And the moves were just like dope. I had to kind of include that in the piece because I just felt like it was just so raw and like totally since 1968. Like mashed potato, the jerk, the monkey, the Boston kind and the regular kind, the Madison. It was this little groove, I, you know, I made it a traveling groove and kind of switched it up to make it a little bit more 2014. This shit is dope. Yeah. Um, you know, I was also inspired by this yeah. film, you know, the the girl in the front that's singing her ass off, and two girls. Also, like, Tina Turner, the way her and her background dances interacted, like, it was like a performance, so, you know, I took some things from that. Also, you know, locking, I have a little bit of, um, you know, information from my hip hop foundation, um, but just seeing it in this real environment was just dope and, you know, it gave me like a whole different perspective in the way it's broken down these days, so dope as fuck. Um, yeah, found a great playlist, that soul dancing. You know, I just wanted a collective view of everything that was going, at the, going on at the moment. All those dancing together, something amazing, and like as you can see, they're going off like freaking amazing. Thank you so much to my dancers again. They'll tell you like I'm a super nerd, looking up fashion from that period and like sending them like a collage so they you know can get their wardrobe together. But um, it was fun. Dancers, like if you ever have anything like this, do your research. You'll find out so much, and as dope as you think you are, you'll find out just how dope people were <laughs> back then. It's like perfecting your craft. If you know your craft, you know your craft. So do that shit. It's fun. Um, you can see my influences, my inspirations. Um, yeah.